So what we did was we set up a small studio on location to scan Margot Robbie's face and give us the overall head model with textures and expressions. We then took that data into Maya and used the scan to build the final CG model with four different makeup looks. So I knew if I have these two techniques, somewhere we will be able to make it work. On the shoot, we set up six witness cameras synced to the time code of the 35mm camera, which allowed us to have an accurate position of Margot Robbie in every shot in each stadium. It really freed up the work, and then the great thing with, with Eight Effects is we're seeing the world. I mean, we're doing these shots that are, you know, I think there's one shot that it's three shots stitched together, ends up being like two and a half minutes. That is non stop and seeing everything. As with sound or music, when effects actually start coming in and, and you start to really see the movie and not just what you hope the movie's gonna be, and it just becomes alive. It's such a difference. A full stadium is very different than an empty stadium. <laughs> and the actual actress's face on her body is very different than somebody else with a little orange ball on top.